Hey guys, it's Core Ross and welcome to Six News. So the latest patch of the test server has added in the brand new Ranked 2.0. Now we can't play it yet, but we can check out the Ranked rewards and the menu for the entire system. And it is going to become playable on the test server at some point so we can see exactly how the system plays before it goes live. And the first thing is that the map pool for Ranked is changing with Nighthaven Labs coming in and Favela being pulled out. And then the next tab is my rank and this shows wins, kill to death ratio, losses, abandons, win rate and matches played and of course it'll show your rank there once you've played. Which will always begin at copper and you'll progress up as you play in this new ranking system but that takes us to the ranked rewards. And you can see that it says that there's 8 ranks total each with 5 divisions and those divisions are 100 points apart and you will move up 1 division until you reach champion. And then it's got a little bit of text about the rewards. It says at the end of the season, you will be rewarded with your highest rank, but also the ones below it. So you can see that we have a charm there for copper and we have a player background for copper. You'll get both of them along with every reward above that. You also see that you get alpha packs as you level up to the divisions as well. I would love if they just gave you the alpha packs straight away, but it does sound like you'll actually have to wait until the end of the season. But that's kind of cool too. You do get a bulk of alpha packs starting at the next season, which I'm not going to be unhappy with. And every rank's rewards is the same. One charm, three alpha packs, a player background. However, the champion is a little bit different. You will get a charm, a background, and a single alpha pack if you are able to attain the champion rank. And you'll notice there is no divisions within that rank. You just get there and you are a champion. And then the rest of the menus here, the gameplay, match format and maps are as you would expect, just the same as from previous ranking system. Now at this point, there's still a few unanswered questions about rank 2.0 because during the live stream, they talked about a demotion shield as a feature of this new ranking system. There's no mention of that in the text on the menu right now. What I believe that probably is a fancy way of saying that you cannot go down in ranked. I think the only way that your rank may go downwards is if your game that you played was with a cheater on it and they had to scrub that as they currently do. They recalculate the MMR that you get. I could imagine they will take away those rank points if a cheater has obviously won a game. But at the time of making this video, they have not actually said what the demotion shield is. Like I say, I think it's just going to stop you going down in ranks at all. I think this will be a linear progression, but I could be wrong. And let's also jump back to the ranks because, of course, they've added in a brand new rank, which is Emerald. And I think the reason is they just wanted an extra division in there just to kind of make you still feel like you're progressing through at a good pace instead of spreading them out too long over the entire season. So they've added in a new division just to kind of keep that progress a little bit longer but still give you some stuff for achieving it but yeah i'd love to know what you guys think of this brand new in-game menu for rank 2.0 and what we know so far about the system and it should go live at some point in the test server we will be able to play it and then of course it will hit the live servers on december 6th and i'd love to know your guess on how easy or hard do you think champion will be to get to because it could be that the more ranked games you play the less points you get or things like that to slow down your progress Maybe there's only going to be a few people that get up there or maybe everyone will eventually get a champion. I don't know. So I'd love to hear your guesses in the comments below. But thank you very much for watching. I'll catch you next time.